Welcome to stage 20 of the 2016 Tour de France. In recent years, the Tour de France has had a grand finale at places like Alpe d'Huez last year on the eve of the Parisian Parade. But the novelty of 2016 is a downhill grand finale at Jouplan. And it isn't just any other climb. It's one of the alpine passes that many riders fear the most. Even Lance Armstrong was afraid of that one. It's the last of four climbs featured on a relatively short stage of 146.5 kilometers. And everything can happen and anything can happen. Say both Roman Bardet and Chris Froome, amongst others. They know the history and the characteristics of both the uphill and the downhill. Naira Quintana knows it particularly well too in the 2012 Criterium de Dauphiné. The Colombian claimed his first ever victory at the world tour level when he descended to perfection after he had rode, rode away from the peloton on the way up the Chouplan. Since the Tour de France launch in October last year, He's been awaiting this moment. However, he would he would have enjoyed a better form, but he's still up there, third on GC, with the likelihood of possibly moving up one spot, or maybe two, as anything absolutely at all can happen. But eh, Quintana, Adam Yates, Richie Port, Fabio Aru, Alejandro Valverde are all within two minutes and nine seconds of each other. And not to mention the fact that Louis Menkes is now only 2 minutes 23 behind Yates. So, it ain't over till it's over, as the proverb says. That brings me to the end of my preview of stage 20 of the 2016 Tour de France. Remember to like, share, subscribe, post any comments, questions, or criticisms in the comment section down below. And last but by no means least, remember, stay carved up for the win. I'll see you next time. Cheers. Whoa. Oh. 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 Oh.